right, boys and girls, I'm going to talk a little bit about um, Polish folk art flowers. So here's a handout that I put in your art kit, and it really shows about two different kinds of flowers, ones that have a U-shape and kind of a U-shape, and then others that have a radial design, which are circles. Um, and so I'm going to do a, a, in my sketchbook, I'm going to show you just some ideas just to get you started. So um, your sketchbook is a lot bigger than mine, but um, that's okay. Um, the first thing I want to do is to practice a few lines because um, folk art is, is very simple in design and so it uses very simple lines. So getting some practice in is a good idea. So here's a few um, castle lines and then some zigzags, which you could do close together or far apart. Um, we can call this a scallop, and then the upside, or the upside down of that, we call it bumpy line. Um, there's also wavy lines, and then you might have some broken lines, or dotted lines, all different kinds. And we're going to be using these as we create our, our floral um, blooms from Poland. So the first design that we talked about was the U-shaped design. So um, you're just going to be making a U and then to break up your flowers you're going to break them into three different sections. So you're going to do one line for the top, one kind of line in the middle, and then the third line at the bottom. So it really doesn't matter which ones you choose. So the creativity is all up to you as you create your masterpiece. And um, I'm just doing a quick, quick sketch. So sketches are things that you, they're for practice. It's not for your final masterpiece. So um, I'm going to do another sketch of a circle. And so I like to get, I'm going to turn it a little bit for my hand. I kind of get my ghost writing going so that I get the practice of the circle before I actually put my pencil down. And then now, there we go. And I find that I do better circles that way. Um, so then I'm going to give my, my radial art flower a center. And then I think I'm just going to do some straight lines out. Uh, oh, I could add little hearts to every other line because um, they did have some hearts in some of their design. And this could be my flower. Um, or I could add the scallop around to make petals. Um, we're going to be using lots and lots of bright colors for these. So, um, Right now it's just the design part. The second part are like leaves, just doing it, gonna show you a quick little leaves. Um, so a lot of people like to start with leaves that look like kind of like footballs. So I always start at the stem and I kind of come out in a curve and then I go back to the stem and I go out and then I try to find that point. And I don't always get it, but close, top, and that one, I kind of made a little curve at the top. You could do zigzag leaves. Again, I start at the stem, and then I do the two zigzag sides, and then I just try to make the meat at the top. Um, you could also do some cloud-shaped leaves. It's really up to you. Just nice, simple, basic designs in your sketchbook before you get started.